Welcome back guys to a new Boom Beach video and today we are going to be fighting for rank 18 there only a couple of attacks there hopefully we can indeed get those uh wins and grab this rank chest and for today we're going to grab this chest and we're going to work on the next one but this one is going to allow us to go ahead and grab these zookas there so we're going to grab the zookas and then we're going to grab the Dr. Kavan there, we're going to go down, grab some more GBE, and then it's just straight up saving for the next engine room. So it might be nice to grab the artillery, but I'm not too sure about that at the moment. And it would definitely be nice to have the boom mines. Once I see people having maxed um, heavies, which won't be too long right now, I might consider going back and getting them. So this clustered base design would work a bit better if I had the defensive building damage node unlocked a bit more because as you can see in the multi node picks i had picked the troop damage instead of the building damage there and over here some more troop damage instead of the building damage so not too good here it's more offensive nodes right there but hopefully this cluster base will hold off until we can get into the next end room and we'll do a base design change after that because we will be unlocking shocks there in the next end room. So we're going to go back into a spread, spread out base design in the next end room. So let's see how today goes for us. We might even consider using the Zookas. Right now they're level 1. So we will have to upgrade them a tiny bit. Okay, so this is our first player who's in the next end room. And it looks like... So we know what we have to do. We have to do a split attack for sure. We'll drop one down there and one down right here. Drop three over here and drop the last tree right there and i think we need distraction over here mostly and we'll drop down the good captain over there and let's see so it looks like it's a good good deck layout for sure massive area uh, gap in the middle there so let's see how that works out and i'm guessing with the captain here we should be able to do a couple of bomb bombing runs here in a second especially in this area here so there it is and let's activate the bombing run i hope that it should be able to take out the engine room also there and okay i took it out a decent amount right there so let's keep working away here we've got maxed heavies here so that should be pretty decent let's get ready to start flaring here i think we've only got two more uh, regular cannons we have to face here but we should be able to show down critters on them and get the win here so let's flare over there Let's activate the captain's bombing ability right there. The last one. Activate bombings right there. Desperately trying to flare to the last one. And there it is. I don't think we could have done that any more better there. And since our base is clustered, he probably did not have to walk the deck too far there. Unlike us, where we had to cover the full deck area. So, 2 minutes 52 he got. 3 minutes 38 seconds we got. So, that's too bad there. Let's go ahead, claim this guy right here, and the Kavan, Dr. Kavan will certainly, certainly be nice to have, especially in the later half of the warship season, having his ability to bring back second wind troops, uh, when we use heavy choppers and those bombardiers right there. So, next end room has loads of nice stuff right there, it's got even the shock, uh, shock mines right there, some building damage node, barrage to take out the uh mine mine clearance right there some more troop damage over here what do we have okay so this is nice i would go since i don't have rockets here i'll probably go towards the troop damage there and then we're gonna get the bombardiers there's a bombardier uh multi-node here somewhere maybe i've skipped it already no it's over there at the very end so we've got that to look forward to so we might consider grabbing these we've got two million upgrade tokens there so we could actually um max them out it doesn't it doesn't take too much upgrade tokens there you can see so let's go ahead hop into another battle and if we swap out the rockets for the zookas that would give us more gbe to activate the captain's uh, bombing ability plus try out some more critters so let's see so we're not going to use critters against this guy he's got rockets there so let's see what we should do let's go in from this side one, two, three right there, and we'll just do one over there, and drop those guys over there. The captain certainly need him in the center over here. 
Okay, and I think we need to start considering bringing in three heavy choppers from now on here. His base does look a bit tough here. Critters over there. And we'll just do critters over here as well. Okay, decent, decent, decent. Let's do the bombing one right there. Which way is he going to go? Okay, if we didn't really... That was not too good right there. So critters on that. And boom cannon over there. Okay, all those critters have died. What's going to happen down here? So those guys at the top should be fine there. It's only got to worry about these guys down here. If only the captain would come down here, we could really use his bombing, bombing ability right here. And yeah, he is. He's coming down. Let's activate it right there. That engine at the top is about to go down. Okay, let's activate another bombing one if we can. Yes, we can. And we got a decent time here. Come on, Captain. There it is. 2 minutes, 48 seconds. Okay, so that's decent. I'm pretty happy about that. Let's take a look at what he's doing. He's got two more engines to, engines to go. And 3 minutes, 35, 34. Probably 3 minutes, 30 seconds there, guys. So super nice there. And we both had the pretty much exact same uh, stats right there. So it was a pretty fair battle right there. Let's go ahead. Is that going to be 11 stars? Maybe some extra stars from the first winner of the day? No, not yet. So we still have to do one more attack here. If we can get 11 stars, I'd be super chuffed here getting that juicy rank chest. Okay. Okay, let's see where which way we're going to go over here. So we'll do... We'll have to do... Let's bring one over here. Bring two up there. And we'll have one set of group going over there. And we'll try and converge in on the middle in a second here. So once that cyber tower goes down. There it is. Drop these guys down. And I think that might have been too early guys. Hopefully those critters will distract those single shot buildings. Yes it will. Just about there. And I might activate those bombing ones right there. We haven't lost any rock choppers just yet there. We might lose some up, up over here though, where that Doom Cannon is. Okay, let's activate the bombing ability. Okay, we're spreading ourselves out a bit thin here. We still got one rocket still alive at the top, so that's uh, good news. Come on. Let's see, where is the captain? He is over there, so let's just activate him. Get that boom cannon taken out. We're about to flare to the last engine there. Uh, no more captain's ability. Yes, we did, but we used it on um, critters right there. So come on, let's go. And there it is. If we hadn't done a split attack, that would have been even slower there. So he has retreated. Can we please get 11 stars here? He has retreated. Okay, so that's nice. Is his rocket chopper going to go down there? No, he's not. He's going to be able to escape. So that's fine. Let's go back. What's it going to be, please? No, we're still one one star short right there. So fingers crossed here. This is going to be it for rank 18 right here. So let's see what's going to happen. Hopefully someone who isn't too far ahead of us anyway. No one using Seekers for sure or uh, Captain Bullet there. Okay, let's see what's going to happen here. So I definitely want to drop down one over there. And one over here. Okay, let's see what's going to happen. So I think we're looking good here. Let's just save up our GB for right now. We could use the captain's ability here in a second. Okay, we're looking okay, okay, yeah. So I'm just watching both sides for right now, guys. And we've got a small amount of heavies out in the front line at the top there. The heavy chopper is down, but that's fine. Come on, heavies. Okay, I think we, we got all the splash damage or the single shot buildings uh, gone out of the way there. We're on the last couple of buildings here. So let's flare onto this one. No, let's actually take out this darn uh, cannon right there. And then we'll flare over there. Okay, we're almost ready there. And now flare back here. 
critters to help them out. And what's that going to be? 2 minutes 43. Okay, not great there. 2 minutes 50 would be a little bit better there. But let's see what's going to happen. 243. Okay, he's there. He's on the last two as well. 47, 46, 45, 44. And there it is, guys. Luckily, we were able to grab the wind there. And he's deciding to flare to the last engines one at a time, which is going to slow him down even more there. So I'm pretty happy about that. That's going to help towards the keys for Kavan right there. And let's take a look at the stars. So, yeah, we still get 10 stars. That's fine. Lovely stuff there. Okay, let's go ahead and grab the doctor here. I don't think I'm going to spend any upgrade tokens upgrading him just yet because we're still going to keep using uh, the Captain Rudy right there. So we'll keep it. We'll keep the upgrade tokens for the GB node right here, even though we've got over 1.8 million upgrade tokens. So let's just hop right into it. We, we might consider using him in one of these battles. Let's go ahead see what's going to happen here. Are we going to get kicked out of 18 as soon as we got into it? So this one might might have been a good position to use uh, Captain Kavan right there. Let's go ahead and we'll just we'll come at it from one side here. Might be a little bit safer. Clears over there. Okay, there it is. So the heavies are falling on this side of the gap right now. So we need them falling on the opposite side. Ooh, we have lost our first heavy chopper right there, guys. And all those heavies have fallen on the opposite side of the uh, landing area that we want them to. So that's not good at all. Let's go over here. We definitely got to keep these guys together. Let's throw down critters over there. Because I know the rock choppers are going to move super fast and be in front of the... Heavy choppers for a split second, and that's all it takes to take these guys down. Okay, let's uh, come down over here. If we can come down over here and then activate the bombing ability here, that'd be pretty good if we can take out that darn doom cannon here. And no, we didn't really get, get to take it out as much as I wanted there. Let's activate it another time. That's amazing. Let's go back now. Let's retreat. Critters over there. Hopefully we don't lose any. And let's go ahead. Flare over there. We're going to have to flare to, the, to this last one here. Which means we're going to definitely lose a couple of rockets here in a second. And two minutes. Okay, so super slow time. I don't know what happened there. But let's take a look at what he's doing. Two minutes 27 is the time to beat. 2 minutes 19, wow, lucky, they're so lucky today, guys. 2 minutes 14 is the time that he got, okay. So I'm pretty happy about that. We just about maintained rank 80, and that gives us a buffer of one attack that we can still lose and stay in rank 80. No, actually two attacks there, because we've got 18 and 23 stars. So guys, that's going to be it from me today. Let me know how you guys are getting along and tomorrow just a bit more gbe and then saving up for the next engine want to keep making progress up there got tons of nice stuff in the next engine of course so let me know where you guys are at and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe i'll see you guys next time